Hello viewers, welcome to the channel Amazing Civil Engineering Studies. In today's video we are going to discuss about Methods of Damp Proofing House Construction. What is Damp Proofing? Damp proofing is a method or treatment used to prevent dampness to enter through walls or floors into the interior property of the building. Dampness can be seen in much property, especially older properties which may have been constructed without a damp-proof membrane. But some of the new properties also experience this problem because of water leakage, heavy rainfall, change of temperature, etc. Causes of Dampness in Buildings Heavy Rain Smashing Low Level of Sight Drainability of Soil Atmospheric Condition The Defective Orientation of the Building Moisture Entrapped During Construction Defective Construction e.g. Joints Use of poor quality bricks which ultimately absorb a lot of water. Use of poor quality of concrete, permeable concrete. Effect of dampness It causes musty smell and damp and mildew or mold forming on walls. It causes peeling wallpaper, staining of wall coverings, and blistering paint. Damp walls and dark patches. Fragmenting plaster and discoloration. It leads to the decay of timber by wood rotting fungi or the presence of wood boring weevils. Dampness symptoms visible on skirting boards, where nails or screws show signs of rust. It develops rusting on angle beads within damp plaster work. It causes the appearance of salt stains on outside walls. Cement plaster mortar on the outside of the property begins to crumble away. Methods of Damp Proofing The following are the various methods of damp proofing for foundation. Membrane Damp Proofing Internal Damp Proofing Surface treatment Cavity wall construction Gunniting Membrane damp proofing In this method, a water resistance membrane or damp proof course, D. PC is introduced in between the source of dampness and the part of the building adjacent to it. DPC may consist of flexible materials such as bitumen, mastic asphalt, bituminous felts, plastic or polythene sheets, metal sheets, cement concrete. The DPC can be introduced or placed either horizontally or vertically in floors, walls, etc. Damp proofing course provided basement is normally termed as tanking. The following points should be kept in mind while providing waterproof course. The DPC should cover the full thickness of walls, excluding rendering. The mortar used for DPC should be leveled and even, 
and should be free from projections so that damp proof course is not damaged. DPC should be laid in such a way that a continuous projection is provided. While providing DPC at junctions and corners of walls, the horizontal damp proof course should be laid continuous. When horizontal DPC is continued to a vertical face, a cement concrete fillet of 7.5 cm radius should be provided at the junction. Continuous correct relation should be maintained between two damp proof courses, to ensure a complete and continuous barrier to the passage of water from floors, walls, or roof. Care taken that no damp proof course left out of wall surface, otherwise, it can get damaged during wall finishing. Damp proof membrane cost, Rs 80 kg bitumen waterproofing membrane thickness, 3 to 8 mm cost, Rs 45 square feet. Internal Damp Proofing In this method of damp proofing, some waterproofing compounds are added to the concrete mix, so that it becomes impermeable. Following are some waterproofing compounds that may be used for internal damp proofing. Compounds made from chalk, talc, Fuller's earth, which may fill the voids of concrete under the mechanical action principle. Compounds like alkaline silicates, aluminum sulfate, calcium chlorides, etc. This compound chemically reacts with the concrete to produce waterproof concrete. Compounds like soap, petroleum, oils, fatty acid compounds such as stearates of calcium, sodium, ammonia, etc. work on the water repulsion principle. When this compound mixed with a mix, concrete becomes water resistant. Commercially available compounds like Pueblo, Permo, and Silca, etc. The amount of chemical compound added to cement is depends upon the manufacturer's recommendations. For general waterproofing work 1 kg of chemical compound per 1 bag of cement to render the mortar or concrete waterproof. Permachemicals waterproof liquid cost, Rs 421 liter. Cavity wall construction the method of cavity wall construction is an effective method of damp prevention. In this the main external wall is shielded by an outer skin wall, leaving a cavity between the two. The cavity leaves a gap between walls which prevents the moisture from traveling from the outer to the inner wall. Gunniting. In gunniting, the exposed damp surface is covered with an impervious layer of rich cement mortar is deposited under pressure over the exposed surfaces for waterproofing or over pipes, cisterns, etc. for resisting the water pressure. The gunniting of mix or spraying of mix operation is carried out by use of a machine known as cement gun. 
This cement gun machine having arrangements for mixing materials and a compressor for forcing the mixture under pressure through a 5.0 mm a flexible hose pipe. A nozzle is fixed to the hose at its free end to which water is supplied under pressure through a spirate connection. In this method, before gunniting is done the surface to be treated is first thoroughly cleaned of dirt, dust, grease, or loose particles and wetted properly. As the surface is sufficiently wet a cement mortar consists of one, three cement sand mix, is shot on the clean surface with the help of a cement gun, under a pressure of 2 to 3 kg cm2. The distance between the nozzle of the machine and the surface to be gunite is kept at a distance of about 75 to 90 centimeters. The mortar used for uniting treatment should be desired consistency and thickness can be deposited to get an impervious layer. The surface should be properly cured at least for 10 days. In this method, to ensure dense compaction and better adhesion of the rich cement mortar is applied under pressure with the help of a gunniting gun and hence the treated surface becomes waterproof. Thank अरे तू बात का भी बेस कर रहा है रे रे बता बात का भी बेस वो बहुत बहुत उन तो काली कर रहा हूँ तो आ रहा हूँ तो मामा देखा ना जो दे आठ जो दे आठ अरे जब तो ढंडा ना छूटे हो यारो फायर को ढंडा Thanks for watching. For now, please subscribe, like, share and do not forget to press bell icon.